Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you some layering combinations that I have been wearing this summer. So they're going to be perfumes, body sprays, and some lotions this time. So if you want to see what I have been wearing for the summer, then just keep watching. And you might not see my face again, so I'm going to do it a different style this time. I'm just going to be turning the camera around and showing you guys what I have. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with the video, and I hope you guys like it. So for the first combo I have here, I have the Miss Dior Cherie Eau de Parfum and the Sparkling Orange Spritz. Um, this smelled so good, you guys. It smells like the Sparkling Orange Spritz has Sun-Kissed Mandarin, Bubbly Prosecco, and Citrus Soda. And I know that the perfume, it has some mandarin orange, some strawberry, and I think it has a little bit of sandalwood. But this combination together, the uh, orange and the mandarin and the strawberry, it just goes, it blends so well together. Like you're going to be walking around smelling like a big orange, like orange juice, orange squeeze, you know, squeeze orange juice. But then that per that Mr. Your Cherie, it gives it a perfumey, it gives it a mature, perfumey, just sultry scent. Like you just smell good, mature, and it just ties that orange all together. So they go so well together. And yes, this is the Mr. Your Cherie from I think the year 2012 or 2013. Yes, I have had it ever since then, but I've had another one that I went through, so this is my second bottle. So you guys, try this combination out if you have those two, and let me know how you like it. So the next combination I have is the Britney Spears Fantasy with Bath & Body Works Fiji Pineapple Palm. So the Fantasy perfume, it says that it has top notes of kiwi and fresh lychee. Middle notes are orchid, white chocolate. Base notes are sandalwood and pink musk. And I do know that the Fiji Pineapple Palm, pineapple, mango nectar, palm leaf, toasted sugar cane, and white musk. And so all of those notes it just blends into this tropical, sweet, sugary pineapple scent. Pineapple and kiwi mixed with sugar, tropical notes, and floral notes. Um, it really does smell like you are on an island. And even the green little crystals in this match the bottle here with the green here. I don't know. Somehow these fragrances be trying to tell me something. <laughs> But that was a, um, and this combination lasts all day. I did not have to respray. Like once I sprayed everything and put my lotion on and let the fragrance settle in, I did not need to touch up this fragrance at all. So if you have those two, try the combination out and let me know how it goes for you. This next combination I have is Coach Dream Sunset with Dahlia. Bath & Body Works Lotion, and Victoria's Secrets Bare Vanilla & Bloom. So this combination right here was like a night out scent. It smelled so good. The Dahlia mixed with the Coach Dream Sunset, they kind of smell similar. They have um, a similar scent profile. And so the notes in the Dahlia are oh they don't have it they don't have it on the back here but anyway they go they they go well together they smell similar um and this here bad vanilla is in bloom it has notes of um vanilla orchid and gold golden amber and so it just smells like a warm sandy beach um <laughs> just like it's just it's meant for the summer just to smell together with the vanilla the sandalwood um that orchid in there 
it just smells so good so yeah if you have these combinations if you have the dahlia try the coach sunset drinks with that and if you have um i think any type of bare vanilla um flanker will go well with the coach dream sunset so try it out and let me know how you like it my next combo is the oscar de la renta extraordinary mixed with bath and body works pink velvet cupcake and pure wonder so the pure wonder it has notes of ice rose star jasmine and warm white amber and the pink velvet cupcake it has notes of sparkling red berries whipped pink marshmallow and sugar praline and the extraordinary perfume it has notes of cherry blossom peony rose magnolia vanilla orchid amber and woody notes so the sweetness of the pink velvet cupcake mixed with the cherry blossom and the vanilla and the rose in this perfume goes so well with this pure wonder because it has the amber and the jasmine and rose also in here so they layer so well together this is fresh the pure wonder is fresh the pink velvet cupcake is sweet so you got a fresh sweet mixture and then the extraordinary perfume is also sweet so you got a fruity fresh sweet floral scent but it smells more sweet than floral so if you have extraordinary or pure wonder or pink velvet cupcake try one or the other or try all three if you would like and let me know how it works out for you and for my next combo i have the bath and body works paris amour and the child by vince camuto so the paris amour it has fragrance notes of French tulips, apple blossoms, sparkling pink champagne, sandalwood, and creamy musk. And the chow perfume, it has notes of rose, peony, lily of the valley, passion flower, pink jasmine, and honeysuckle. But they both have like champagne notes. So the chow perfume smells like a tropical alcoholic drink somewhat and the Paris Amour does have that champagne note the Paris Amour is slightly powdery but the chow perfume is sweet and it does have those florals in there it has passion flower lily of the valley jasmine and honeysuckle in the chow perfume so those florals go so well with the Paris Amour and the Paris Amour has those French tulips in here and apple blossoms so those are florals and also has that musk. So the Paris Amour gives depth to the chow perfume. So it makes it sweet and it makes it like a deeper scent with the Paris Amour and it makes it powdery. And um, it just brings out those sweet notes and those florals. And the powder is actually, it turns into like a powdered sugar type of scent. So if you mix it with that child perfume, with the sweetness of that child perfume, they make a great combination together. If you have those two, pair them together and tell me how you like it. And for my next combination, I have the White Mango Chill from Bath & Body Works and Giorgio Armani My Way. So the Body Mist, it has notes of Jasmine, Lily of the Valley, Mango, and Orange Blossom. Um, it was kind of hard to find the notes because it is an older scent, so I'm sure that it's not all the notes. Um, so that's all I could find at the moment. And for the Giorgio Armani perfume, it has orange blossom, bergamot, tuberose, and Indian jasmine. So they both have orange notes, and I think they both have jasmine in them. So um, I don't know. I just picked it up, and I smelled it, and I said, ooh, this might go good with the My Way. So I just paired them together and y'all, it made a combination so sweet and so juicy and um, so sultry. It actually can be a date night scent. So it's not loud at all. And it just forms this bubble, this cloud around you. 
um, that lasts and lasts and lasts. It did not fade. I still smelled the body mist. I still smelled the perfume. And they blended so well together. And I know y'all are asking, well, how in the world you get these old scents? Well, I used to work at Bath & Body Works in about around 2014 or 15. So I still have some old scents from, from that time. But I also took some of those old scents and I traded them in for some new scents. So yes, that is how I still have some of these old scents because I used to work at Bath & Body Works. Okay, now for my last combination, I have Pure Seduction and the Mon Paris. And yes, I do use my perfumes. So, the Pure Seduction, it says that it has notes of plum, freesia, and melon notes. And to me, it smells like, um, like grapes, cherries are in, in there, and it smells like fruit punch. And so, next we have the Mon Paris. And that has notes of raspberry, pear, orange, tangerine, peony, jasmine, patchouli, vanilla, musk, and cedar. So this combination, it just gives a nice fruity floral scent. Um, the Pure Seduction Body Mist with the plum and the melon, it just amps up that raspberry note and that orange note inside of the Mon Paris, it blends so well together. It does kind of smell like love spell a little bit. Like once you get to, once they mingle in together, it gives a scent almost like love spell, but it has this level of maturity to it that it doesn't smell childish. It smells like a grown woman scent. So yeah, those floral notes, those fruity notes, it makes a beautiful combination a bomb, sweet, fruity, floral scent. So guys, that's all I have for you today. And I will be coming back with some more combinations for you all. So just keep your notifications on so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. And thank you. And I hope um, whoever is watching, if you are not subscribed to my channel, now please hope that you subscribe. And I hope that this is a, um, a place that you can come to where... You can get like, you know, different layering combos. And yeah, I just hope that you are enjoying this channel as much as I am. And that, um, you know, everyone is having a good time here. So thank you all and tune in to the next one.